Hey, what is up? It is Adam, owner of Brookside Landscape and Design, and we are standing in front of, whoops. This is Joe Grosso's office, Kitsap Insurance Group. Uh, I believe his business is four or five years old. Five years old, I think, about the same as us. Uh, maybe a little older, but he's been our insurance agent for, well, since we started the business. Um, met him through a networking group, became a good friend. Um, anyways, we are out here at his property, his new building right here on Silverdale Way, putting in a custom fountainscape and a landscape. One of the things that we want to try to do this year is get a couple more display features in the ground so that people can help, people can visualize water features in their own backyard living space. Um, sometimes it's hard to imagine what you can do uh, in your backyard, but if you have somewhere you can look at it um, and get it, you know, help visualize and picture it in your backyard, it's a great thing for that. So anyways, enjoy this video of this custom fountain here. Okay, so we are pretty much mostly demoed. Um, we've got all of our, our lawns stripped and the weeds pulled. We got a pile of brush there and a pile of sod there to still haul out. But uh, for the most part, we are uh, <clears throat> done so on the demo. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna mock all our stuff up, see what kind of a shape we want for our fountain and then get to digging. up here end of day one uh, on this fountain build we've got uh we've got mark throwing stuff at me as usual uh last time it was squirting water and this time it's throwing roots um there's our basin we kind of wound up stepping it up from our original plan uh we let our creativity get the better of us but uh we've got all that brush out of here all that dirt out of here so tomorrow, Mark and I are going to come out to do uh, lighting and plumbing. So it should be a fun day tomorrow. Uh, that's kind of where we're at right now. We've got everything plumbed up. Uh, we've got a manifold in there, uh, and there's another one. Um, we've got all of our features here, our bowls. And then uh, we tried something a little new here with doing like a stack slate look to kind of wrap up the front of everything here. So um, should be pretty sweet once we are all wrapped up. Whoa! That's crazy! Yeah, we gotta mess with the ball valves, but it works. All right, do the next one. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Oh, that one's gonna go first. It's gonna be so cool. Mark seems less than pleased. What are your thoughts, Mark? Uh, check, come check out this one, the way it's falling off. Because it's because because the way you or because of the way it's plumbed or whatever. Yeah. Comes out at an angle. Kind of cool. Oh yeah. Much more noticeable from straight on. Yeah, that's pretty cool, dude. Pretty stoked. I'm pretty freaking stoked. We've got 
our plants, courtesy of Puget Sound Plants. A uh, bunch of low growing stuff, uh, some grasses that we'll put in front, uh, some lavender back too, and um, blue star cedars, some barberries, some rainbow lacothas, kaleidoscope abelias, and heavenly bamboos that'll be kind of on the sides and in the back. They only get about four feet tall, so um, those will kind of be a nice backdrop. So yeah, today we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be done today for sure. So not really. Uh, I've got Mark and Abel. Party! Party! Uh, we have our light set up, so let me show you what that looks like here. Pull up my phone. We've got our uh, our handy dandy Arkenscape app here. Boop, look at that. Uh, go ahead and pull this up. So here's our color wheel. Um, we've got a lot of different features on these lights. Right now I have them set to, to Brookside Fire Orange, but if I want that to be red, maybe you can't see this. Oh, look at that, there we go. Pretty sweet. Got all of our lights here our color freaking changing so there's a couple modes on that we've got a little strobe effect here basically so we can just party out anyway um that's our lights uh we're gonna get the planting done we're gonna get um the rest of the rock in here make this thing look tip top so that way we can be wrapped up anyway check it out All right, everybody, we are finally wrapped up here with our fountain display project for Joe DelGrasso, our insurance agent here, all state in Silverdale. Uh, super fun project. Just kind of got to let our artistic juices flow and enjoy the company of the boys, you know, and hang out and build something sweet. So uh, here it is. We've got those uh, color changing lights in there. That's gonna look really sweet at nighttime when we uh, get to see what, what that does right there. I'm really excited to see how that kind of reflects the, the light bubbling out of the top of the spheres there. Uh, part of the noise, again, we are on Silverdale Way and I'm trying not to look at the camera because that means I'm looking at the street and staring at passing cars. But um, we did a lot of uh, low growing shrubbery, uh, or sorry, did a lot of low growing grasses here in the front. Um, and then kind of around the sides and on the back, we did some higher growing four foot shrubs uh, just to kind of accent and create a little cove for our sweet fountain display. So really fun project, like I said, I uh, can't wait for the next one. In the meantime, to stay up to date, go ahead and uh, subscribe to our channel. Hit the little bell icon there to uh, get notifications of when we release new videos. And then like and comment, tell me how much you want this water feature in your backyard. Anyway, you guys have a good day.